is that first half the best of your reign, do you think, here? Hold on, hold on. Is this a serious interview? <laughs> you big dear. Right, right. Oh. right, do it again. That's oh. fine. Sorry, mate. But that's, yeah, I mean, I've, got, I've had professionals and I've had you. Sure, mate. No, go on, mate. You do what you want. Sorry, mate. Can't do it now. Can't do it now. Go on. <laughs> Yeah, that's fine. <coughs> You're gone, aren't you? I'm gone, yeah. It's me, I can't do it. What was the question? It was... Can you edit it? We can, yeah, but uh, we'll start again. Right, just turn around and just get a straight face. I'll start with the big football story of... <laughs> was the bird just pooed on me, or was that water? That's water. Wow. Start again, yeah? Right, we've been... <laughs> we've been driven inside because of the rain, but I'll start with the first football story. I'll start... Are you beating yourself up? Yeah. It's because John's watching, you're not yeah. used to crowds. Let's go again. We've been driven inside because of the rain, but I'll start with the main football story of last week, which was Nigel Clough sacking. What was your view on that one? My view initially is that we've been driven in the rain, but me not. I'm still getting wet, as you're well aware. You, I've been driven in the rain, my little directorship. Uh, Brian Clough getting sacked. Did sort of give me the heads up that that might... Brian Clough? Brian Clough. And his son. <laughs> They're both big friends of mine, and the lights have gone out, which is a bit stupid, but... And they are... <laughs> and they're both... If the lights don't go out... <laughs> uh, well, we'll and they're back. both big friends of mine. And then moving on to... <laughs> the lights gone out. <laughs> I'm not that bad looking. <laughs> Who said that? Well, moving on to Bristol City before the Lions could tell us interview once more. Um, you've got three guests for that game. Well, actually, there's three and there's another one now. So four guests. We'll start then. It's going well, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> uh, especially uh, if the lights go out and they're all... What a <laughs> idea. What a <laughs> idea, isn't it? Who was the idea for it to come in, John? <laughs> Why don't we just normally go where we're not? <laughs> that's my family. <laughs> um, one exciting event that, that's on the horizon is, um, is a unique quiz show being held at New York Stadium with, with you know, well-known TV celebrities. Uh, the ultimate quiz showdown. I um... <laughs> can't see it. <laughs> God, 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 God. <laughs> There's, I couldn't read the date. I couldn't see. Oh, I got all this. Like, oh, where's the date? <laughs> Tickets price is sixteen. Can we pull that Tickets up? from fifteen. Sort of affect them. And Steve Evans in his build-up this week, as he said, he's just looking for a normal week. I have no idea what I'm going to ask you there. I just started rambling there. Just didn't, I didn't have any idea where I was going with that. Uh, I've got an answer for you anyway. Firstly, Steve, welcome back to Rotherham United. How good is it? Say what? <laughs> Firstly, Steve. Two. Pringles' ball is below his usual standard, and he knows it. Yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, brilliant. That was very good, wasn't it? That was a good one. I'm going to watch that one back because that felt good. Well